Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Jessie. So today y'all, I'm gonna be sharing with you a mobile home makeover. My living room, I did a total makeover on my living room. And instead of just filming it and showing you the makeover, I wanted to do something a little different. So I'm gonna share with you where my living room was, how it looked like before I moved in here and where it's at today. I'll um, talk about all of the updates that we've done, the makeovers, all of that good stuff. Um, just so you can compare how far this uh, living room has come just keep in mind we still are not done we do plan on doing a few more makeovers in here and then we still got to do of course flooring all throughout the house but that is going to be the last thing we do but anyways y'all i'm so excited for today's video let me go ahead and show you what this living room looked like when we first purchased this home and what it looks like now so if y'all are ready let's get to it So this is what the front door looked like. It was just the plain chrome um, and the door was actually white. It did definitely need a coat of paint immediately um, because it just had some spots all over it that I guess someone had banged on the door or whatever. But um, here it is. You can definitely tell it needs a paint of coat. It actually be replaced, but I just went ahead and painted it for now. Um, that way we could make up our minds and figure out what we actually wanted it before we replaced it. Um, but the door functions very well. It's just ugly. <laughs> uh, but here's the living room. As you can see, it definitely needed to be painted. So we did paint right before we moved in. Um, but as you can see, there was like all different kinds of paints on the wall. It didn't match. Um, the flooring looked okay for the most part. Um, but it did need to be placed in some spots, but eventually all of the flooring in the house is going to be replaced. And here is a, another view. This is in the kitchen looking into the living room. You can definitely tell a difference here. Um, we did a lot of painting, y'all. And now you can see where we are at right now. As you can see, the front of the door looks a little different. So I did paint the trim to the glass door black and then I did paint the door a sage green color that I absolutely love. It is a very pretty green. So walking into the front door you will see the entryway and I love this spot in my home. This is like one of my favorite spots here. I think it's so pretty. Um, but I have this beautiful, beautiful bench here um, that I purchased off Facebook Marketplace that I absolutely love. And I just paired it with a few pillows. And then my husband actually built this shelf for me. And I did have it in a different spot in my living room, if you remember. Um, but now it's here with the three beautiful mirrors that I love. And just some decorations. I do feel like I will change some of the decorations eventually. Um, but for right now, that's what I have up there. I just love the greenery and just all of the decor up there. It's so pretty. And I love that windmill. I just wish that windmill was a different color so it didn't blend in. But eventually it will find a new spot to sit in and then I'll have something different up there. But yes, yeah, so I love this spot. And I also love the home sign right behind the door. I think it's just very, very pretty. And then we also did do a shiplap wall here, as you can tell, all the way um, over here until you get to the bathroom. I did paint all of the doors um, as well. It is a, a creamy, um, actually it's called coconut, so the color is um, called coconut. And then I did put some black knobs on the doors as well, and I just love the look. So this is what the entryway looks like. So this is what it looks like when you first walk in. I'll go ahead and give you a different view. And then straight across there, y'all, we have this little half table here that I just have my um, wax warmer on and some wax melts and a cute little um, lamp. I do have a sign up here that I just put up here, but I still plan on doing some more decorating here. Um, I do plan on getting rid of this trim, this decor, moving that, um, just I want to get rid of both of those trims and just making that wall just like a solid piece and then putting a big beautiful 
um, something up there but that is a makeover coming and this is what our new living room looks like I absolutely love it um, so yes y'all it looks completely different um, I did have a um, big huge sectional in here y'all that was just taking up that side um, we didn't really have a whole lot of room to walk into our bedroom it was just too much we decided to go ahead and um, do away with that and get some smaller furniture and I'm so glad that we did so let me go ahead and show you what we got so we have here a um, a sofa that has two recliners built in which is perfect I don't have to have a big recliner in here um, they're built in so that is perfect um, it's just three of us here so there we we can all three fit right there and watch TV together no problem and when it's just me and my husband we can just have the recliners and the puppies can be right between us but I really do love this new sofa it is so cozy it's just I love it so I'm glad we have that it is um, really heavy as well and then we also decided to go ahead and pair the couch with this beautiful chair instead of a big heavy huge recliner um, so I love the way this looks I love the pattern of the chair with the brown light brown color it just matches with the couch it flows so nicely and it just looks so pretty in here and I still have the Highlander picture there and as you can see I now have some green on the walls I do have the bottom painted to the coconut color the same color as the walls and I did do gray on the top it's so pretty so I definitely love the uh, combination of the paint colors the top is like a light gray the bottom is a cream um, and then of course I have the drop cloth curtains they're so pretty and elegant looking I just love them so much um, I still do plan on painting the ceilings eventually we haven't gotten to that yet um, we do have a new ceiling fan in here so we have done a lot in here y'all we still do have a few things that we need to do one of the things we still need to do is to cut those pieces of trim on top of that so we don't have them going all the way up to the ceiling um, we also need to do the same thing for the front door cut the trims on top of the door and um, so they're not going all the way up to the ceiling as well but other than that y'all we um, and a couple other makeovers that we want to do in here the living room is really done we don't have a whole lot to do in here but I just love the way that it looks it's just so cozy and homey now um, I'm gonna go ahead and walk into the kitchen so you can get a, a different view of how it looks so this is me in the kitchen looking into my living room I do have my um, a side table here that I do plan on replacing with something else as well as the coffee table um, I, I feel like I want something else these just have to go but for right now they're in here um, but yeah y'all so this is the new look to my living room I absolutely love it um, comment below let me know your thoughts on it and how you like it I definitely love it so much it feels more open it feels so much bigger in here I love it so yeah y'all so comment below let me know what you think thank y'all so much for watching and I will see y'all on the next one all right bye y'all